Here we go. Officially the top two teams in world football. We can say that now, but only one will wear the crown. It's the World Cup final coming up live on EA TV. Hello, it's good to be with you and we're broadcasting from what is a very special venue for all Australian football fans, Stadium Australia here in Sydney. I'm Derek Ray and keeping me company in the commentary box today is of course Stuart Robson. And it's decision day here at the 2023 World Cup. The final stands before us. It's Spain and they take on Australia. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. Here's the lineup for Spain. Well, the wingers will be key here. They have to choose the right time to give width and the right time to come infield to support the centre forward. If they can do that, they're a potent front three. No doubt about that. And the starting 11 for Australia. Well, in this shape, their two holding midfield players will be key today. If they can get on the ball and dictate the play, protect the two centre-backs, it will then allow the attacking players to show their creative quality. And the contest begins... Top class defending. Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. Badier. Will it be? The save was a good one. <laughs> Elects to go short. Behind for another corner. Can they cash in? Taken short. Well shown inside. Can't miss, surely. And there it is. She's etched her name in history as the scorer of the opening goal in the final. You've simply got to enjoy these moments. Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal.
So underway again here. One nil the score. And out for a throw in. Just misfiring with the pass. Great pressure to win the ball back. Could be. Well, fantastic reflex action. Oh, they have it again. Useful looking position, you've got to say. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Tere Abeyeira. Redondo. Well, far from the ideal pass. Running with the ball confidently. A fine reading of the situation. And can they be creative from here? Now, who can she pick out? It's got to be! Oh, the equaliser! Just what they needed, and the dream remains very much alive. Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box, begging players to attack it, but I'm not sure the keeper should be beaten at that near post. She won't enjoy seeing that again. So, a level contest. 1-1. an interesting pass oh a goal they're in the lead here now well here's the replay and it all starts off with that cross into the box just begging for a teammate to get on the end of it and it ends up with a fairly simple finish certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that is rolling again 2-1 the scoreline Ford well showing excellent judgment to intercept and a close offside decision as they were threatening Sloppy in possession. Cooney cross. On to Gori. Caitlin Ford. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. That is a really disappointing effort. Goodness me. On that occasion, just didn't make the right sort of contact. Should be testing the goalkeeper from that sort of range. Adie. Now with Abeyera. Jenny. Well, it's one pass after another. And a decent save. Full credit.
Well, a short corner here. And the cross not sufficiently well played in. Now, who can she pass it to? Well, not the greatest pass. Easily intercepted. Katrina Gori. Now with Ford. Well, there it is, as expected. Spain have controlled most of the ball so far, but they've shown a real lack of invention today. One or two of their more talented players need to step up now to get them back into this game. Absolutely. And looking to try to take advantage of the possession here. Oh, good-looking run. Nicely saved. Jenny being egged on by the crowd no shortage of excitement level again no wonder they're excited well here's the replay and it has been coming they've played some great football in this game and they fully deserve this goal Again here, this has been quite the roller coaster ride. And the referee blows for a foul. Well, some referees might have elected to hand out the yellow card, but no booking on this occasion. That is that for the first half here. And so the second half gets underway. Almost a case of the two teams saying to each other, whatever you can do, I can do just as well. Effective challenge. Haley Rasso. And space available inside. Oh, surely! Well, decent save there. Who can they pick out? Danger averted. Well, that's how to beat your opponent, but stout defending when it mattered. Abeyera. Badier. Jenny. Bonmati. And clears the danger. Kyra Cooney Cross not giving their opponents a moment's peace. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. Let's see about the delivery. Not to be advised giving the ball away there. An attack full of promise. 
determined defending Kerr can they hit on the break oh lovely weighted ball they might be in oh it's a goal and that gives them the advantage will they be able to keep it Well, as you can see, it's a decent strike, but I'm not sure about the keeper here. She can't be beaten inside that near post. Goal. And the ball is moving again. 3-2. Cooney cross and teammates around her possession one on a bad year Jenny Bon Mati now what can they do from here oh a golden opportunity for her oh she saved it well she's denied a certain goal there fantastic reaction from the keeper and time for the change now. Taken short. A smart stop here. And they will make the change now. Well, the short corner routine. This could level it. And the keeper more than equal to the task. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Played over. And the keeper showing tremendous command. And a short corner, let's see. Well, she's made sure nothing untoward happened. Being pressed hard. Aitana Bonmati. And Hermoso. Breaking at pace. And a decent save. Full credit. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. And now the delivery. Pretty comfortable piece of defending. Will it happen for them? Straight offside, but only just. Ten minutes to go then. Running with the ball confidently. Real chance. And that's a high quality stop. Well, it may not count for anything, but that was a great save, wasn't it?
who's going to get on the end of it in it goes and surely that's the end of the story they cannot throw us away from here Well, let's look at this again. It's a decent delivery into the box, and it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. Goal. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Oh, that's a fine pass. Jenny. And the pass could do damage. Flag raised for offside. And just five minutes remaining. And that puts them in position. Could be. And a goal. If there were any remaining doubts, that will settle the issue. Well, here we can see it again. And it starts with the ball over the top perfectly weighted while the movement in the box is equal to it it's such good timing what a goal well if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome surely they now have been removed Aitana Bonmati. And a big chunk of added time here, a minimum of five minutes. Mariona. Now with Hermoso. Giving the ball away. Ford. Botellas. And there goes the final whistle. How about this? The host nation have done it. Australia are world champions. Well, magnificent scenes here, not just amongst the players, but in the crowd as well. They've been absolutely brilliant throughout the tournament. They fully deserve it. What a night for the Matildas. They rose to the occasion when it mattered and delivered. And now, the Australian players prepare for the trophy presentation, Stuart. Well, just listen to the roar when the trophy is lifted. This is sensational stuff. The world champions, Australia. And the world's advanced Australia Fair, never more fitting. Well, great scenes here amongst the players, amongst the fans. What a tournament they've had. Absolutely brilliant.